got as much of your tape as I could possibly get my hands on. I watched you all the way to your days in CZW where you won championship gold. I watched you go to every single top independent and become the hottest free agent in the world. And then I watched you go down to Florida and shock the system. You were so good. You were Shawn Michaels' hand-picked guy. You were so good. You became the greatest world champion in the history of that company. And that, my friend, is undisputed. Because you were that good. So I followed your footsteps. I went to CZW, where I won gold. I became a top name on the independents. And then I signed on here in AEW. And deep down in my heart, I knew one day you'd make the jump. And when you did, me and you would have the rivalry of a lifetime. Two generational talents, MJF versus Adam Cole. But then, then this guy showed up. What? What happened to you, man? You used to be the Panama Playboy. Now, you're the Panama Game Boy. You sit at home behind your computer, playing Twitch, hiding from the sun, looking like a virgin golem. Meanwhile, Britt Baker keeps leaving the house with your balls firmly in her purse. And to make matters worse, bud, didn't you used to have the body and the physique of a world champion? Now, no offense, you're so frail, you make crack whores jealous. This company has done everything in its power to make you cool. The lights, the music, the cool t-shirts, the big match opportunities, the girl, your own reality show. You know what they do to make MJF cool? They ring the freaking bell. Sound familiar? Greatest singles dog collar match of all time. Greatest Iron Man match of all time! Greatest four-way of all time! The world champion! The best professional wrestler on God's green earth! I have beaten every single top guy these people thought were on my level. What makes you think you're gonna be any different, bud? Really? Uh, was that the best that you got? This is, this is the great MJF, the guy who verbally destroys people on the microphone. And truth be told, I think I finally figured it out. MJF, you are world class. You're a world class douchebag. You dumb, worthless, fat pieces of shit. We're not even on TV yet. Congratulations on your victory tonight, sir. Congrats on having type 3 diabetes, Mark. How may I help you? Eh, not quite. Mm, not quite. Fat, but it's okay. You know what I can do? <laughs> <laughs> now what? Go. Your turn. Let's play horse. And oh my god, my body. How could we not talk about my body? Not like I've heard that one before. You know why you bring that up? Because of my body of work. Uh, the matches that I've had, the interviews that I've done, the world championship reigns that I've had, Max, get real. You can't touch me. But, but if you really, really do want to go down that road, I got an idea, Max. How about me and you both walk backstage? We both piss in a couple of cups, and we see who's natural and who's not. I look nuts. Basically clean? Clean? What does that mean, clean? Oh, that's a, that's a chill son in line. Oh, I don't get it.
Oh, you're asking me if I take steroids? I was saying, yeah, Chael likes to say You think a nice young Jewish boy from Plainview, Long Island, New York? Let's, let's get real here. Oh, oh, you don't want to do that? Yeah, I thought so. I can appreciate and understand that you studied in my career. Now let me tell you a story. There was once a wise Jewish man, and his name started with an M. And when his people were meek and weak, As a wrestler, as a man, they respect me, the human being, Adam Cole. You, on the other hand, Max, I don't know how to make this any more clear. I, I swear on my life, there's not a single person back there who respects you. If you were to go up to any of them and ask, do you respect me? They would laugh in your face. They think you're selfish. They think you're conceited. They think you're lazy. You do the bare minimum, the bare minimum to collect that paycheck and walk around with that world title. Shut my mouth and you would fight me, but you're not doing that because you are a coward, you 